What is going on guys and welcome back to another A Ball Ball video. So for today's video, I am so Crap, wrong intro. Who invited you here anyways, Game On Time? Why are you in my video? Seriously, who even opened up the door and let you into this video? Get out of here, boy! Well, I mean, I guess you can't blame him. I mean, at least his intro is better than Devil 8 Ball Pool's intro. Hey guys, what's going on? It's your boy, Devil Hair, back again with another- Oh no, Devil's intro is better than mine. Whoa, this intro is long. No, I'm way too impatient for this. So now is the alleged time. The time of the sunrise has predict. No, stop. So now the time has come for where I make a case on why I've been gone for f for so long. For those of you who don't care, want to see the video? Go to this time. See if I freaking care. Hello? Is anyone still there? Two of you? All right, sounds like a plan. So guys, in order to actually portray the story so that you can visually see it and actually understand the way I'm portraying it, I actually hired a company of animators to animate the whole thing for you. They're kind of like a branch off of Disney. They made like the Frozen movie and like Aladdin and stuff like that. So I hired them and asked them to use their highest tech technology to animate the story for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed and let's get on with the story. So basically my parents were going out of town for like a few days for some kind of freaking meeting or some crap that I don't care about. And my grandma lives like 30 minutes away from us and she really does like to come over and see us and we like to see her and stuff like that so my grandma was supposed to kind of look after us for the days that our parents were gone and things like that now you need to understand that me and my siblings and stuff we're grown we're, we don't have like a five-year-old we don't have like an infant we don't have a child we're all like above the age of like teen we're all basically teenagers you know what i mean so we have looked after ourselves while our parents are gone multiple upon multiple of times so this was nothing new for us but sadly my mom is a mom and she didn't feel comfortable with us sleeping alone at night without an adult there to kind of like i don't know what my grandma would do if a robber broke in she'd probably just uh, scream and run away and have me and my brothers do this stuff <laughs> but i guess my mom just thought she wanted to have an adult there when it was night even though my brother is technically an adult but still my mom is a mom and you can't do anything about that so we all agreed that my grandma would come during the night sleep with us and then wake up and go home and i looked at this and i was like oh yo though that's pretty cool we're kind of going to be alone for the days and stuff like that that means i could live stream because there's not that much voice you know that type of thing i could also make videos during that time of the day so i thought that you know what this is actually pretty cool i can i can dig this so i was trying to like learn how to live stream because i just kind of wanted to try it out i didn't know how to or anything like that but i was getting ready to give you guys videos and stuff like that and even though we all agreed that our grandma would come during the nights and watch us Nah fam, she stayed during the whole day, every day that my parents were gone. And I hope it doesn't come off as me kind of sounding like, oh dude, why is my grandma here? Oh, I hate my grandma. Why did my grandma have to stay with us the whole day? I just wanted to kind of be alone. And I know there's people out there that kind of had like relatives die. You know, I've had relatives die too. It is kind of sad. But the thing is, I do not hate my grandma by any means. My grandma is awesome. The thing that it was for me is that I couldn't film while my grandma was there. You see, my grandma understands little to nothing about the internet and technology and stuff like that. She just recently got a smartphone like a year ago or something like that and she still asked me for help on how to use it. And I almost guarantee she has no idea what YouTube is. If she hears me screaming in my room, even if I explain it to her, I don't know what that's gonna do to our relationship and I don't wanna find out either. Cause again, she does not understand the internet. She doesn't understand that I can post this video up for you guys to see on YouTube, I bet. So to her, it would look like, unless if I was talking to someone on the phone, to her, what I'm doing looks like to her that I'm just screaming to myself while playing eight ball pool in my room. So I decided to take better judgment and to just kinda just refrain from that so that she doesn't think I'm 
more stupid than she already thinks I am. So then after that, I was kind of busy for the days after that. And now I'm sick. Like I had to blow my nose twice while recording this freaking audio. So if it sounds like my nose is stuffed during this video or that I have a cold, it's because I actually do. And I wanted to get this video out to you guys because I wanted to get it out before the cold absolutely exploded and I was like inaudible and I sounded like an off-brand version of Chewbacca. A few days ago, I thought that it would kind of pass. I'm like, okay, I catch the cold, maybe will go away. It hasn't gone away, so now my voice is like dead. You could probably hear it right now. 10,000 subscribers. What did I do? It's turned into something bigger than I ever imagined to do this quick. I mean, three months? Insane. Like, I don't know if this sounds genuine or not, but I can't insane i'm kind of drawing a blank right now on what i'm supposed to say and plus i think i'm kind of losing my voice because it's not a good idea to scream when you have a cold but the road to nine ball edition 100 i said that backwards the road to 100 million coins nine ball edition will be coming soon because we did hit 10,000 subscribers and about that a lot of you know that i've been talking about this series for months now and then devil eight ball pool kind of uploaded a video on it out of the blue it kind of caught me off of surprise because I thought he knew that I was planning to do the series months in advance. So I actually commented a comment claiming that he stole my idea. The comment got a bunch of likes and then Devil got a few haters off of that and stuff like that for actually making the series. I messaged him asking like, dude, why did you steal my idea and stuff like that? And he actually said that he had no idea that I was planning on doing it. So guys, please stop hating on him because I know that it sounds like, oh, he could be lying. But guys, he seriously sounded like he had absolutely no idea. We're gonna be doing the challenge together. Also, don't forget to comment down below what you actually want the name of the Nine Ball Road to 100 Million account to be. Whatever you guys decide, I will name the player that or I will like pick from a few of them or something like that. But don't forget to comment down what you want the username of the player to be for the Road to 100 Million. Honestly, I'm kind of down for whatever as long as it doesn't get me like terminated off of YouTube or something. Don't forget to write your own name. Maybe if I find it on my like, dude, that is freaking genius. I will actually use it. So don't forget to do that. I'm going to show you guys the videos right now. We have a Berlin match to get the Berlin ring. And then I think I have like two, just really just funny 10 million nine ball matches that I wanted to show you guys. Yes, I was that guy in one of the nine ball matches. You'll see what I mean after you watch the video, but I will see you guys in a second.
there you guys have it. How many tries did it take me to get that last win to actually win the Berlin ring? I got it actually first try. I logged on. I went into a match, and that's the match that you saw where I actually won it. I almost got a denial, but... Uh, I'm stupid. Again, guys, sorry about my voice. I am sick right now. I had to do this before it absolutely exploded. Probably will absolutely explode tomorrow. So you guys are welcome. So I have kind of like a special video planned. It's like a video that I've never seen done before. I don't think there is a video on it. But in order for me to do this video, I need you guys to comment down in the comment section below the exact amount of coins you have in eight ball pool. So say if your coin balance says like 12,863, just comment below. You have 12,863 three coins and I'm going to be picking a few of you for a video in the future also again the road to 100 million series nine ball edition is coming soon so don't forget about that but other than that I hope you guys did enjoy the video and if you did enjoy the video don't forget to leave a like on the video and if you did leave a like on the video don't forget to head over to a grocery store and get all the toilet paper you can buy because um Rest in peace because I'm going to need all I can freaking get. And I will see you guys next time. Probably tomorrow. I'm Ravis and I'm out. Bye. Great, Squidward. You finished. What's your wish? My wish is that the people of Bikini Bottom will stop paying any attention to the inane dribble that is constantly streaming out of this thunderhead's mouth. Gee, Squidward, maybe Santa will bring me a dictionary so I can understand what you just said. I am the one, the way your son don't need a gun to get